all about documentaries. I'm here at the Asian Cultural Center to check out the launch of the Shanghai Documentary Week. If you've always wanted to explore Shanghai but can't find the time, then now is your chance. You can do it from the comfort of your own home, thanks to Shanghai Documentary Week. The Information Office of Shanghai Municipality and Sinovision hosted the launching ceremony last week. Guests describe why they're excited to learn more about New York City's eastern sister city. I think it gives you an image about China, which most of the people probably don't know about of China. So I think that's very, very important to let the American to know much more in details of what's going on in China and, and all the development had in the last past 20 years. And it's interesting to meet people who have come here from China, um, from the Shanghai government, and uh, you know, it's a good opportunity for cross cultural exchange. Distinguished guests from the Shanghai government attended the event along with New York political and industry guests. Shanghai Documentary Week features five films focusing on a variety of topics, including food, history, development, architecture, family, and more. They explore the evolution of Shanghai and how it's become a financial, cultural, and real estate hub. Well, I think that people are interested to know how people in, in Shanghai and China live. So I think that it's important that people understand, you know, the other population over there. Um, and I think that people are interested in that kind of human connection. Whether you've been to China more times than you can count or you're desiring to visit for the first time, Shanghai Documentary Week provides a new look at this city like you've never seen before. One of the things that's really interesting about Shanghai, um, and I think something that you can see in documentaries like this, is that Shanghai is kind of the New York of China. And I think that that's something that will make people in New York especially connect with you know, films about the topic. Um, you know, people in, in Shanghai are really sophisticated and um, it's a really unique kind of culture within China. So, um, you know, I think that that's another place where New Yorkers and Shanghainese people can connect. I've been living in China for many years, so I, it was a big pleasure for me to see again a country where I spent about nearly 10 years of my life. So, I can see still is all the huge develop and the change of the country which is continuing to, to change. And it's, I mean, it's, it's great to see again after a couple of years in which I've been here now in the U.S. For more information on U.S.-China relations, visit our website, en.sinovision.net. Reporting for Sinovision Journal, I'm Christy Clements.